Hey, what's up, everybody? This is Kurt Durgin with Team Kurtrox and Axe Backwards on Discovery Channel's BattleBots TV show. And today we're, we're going to review the Flip Sky Dual Channel ESC. Uh, it's a nice piece of equipment. Just got it in the mail from them. And we're going to put it to the test to see if it's got what it takes to go in our robot. So let's get into it. Let's get this bag open. Came from DHL really fast from Flip Sky. Uh, their box here, lots of bubble wrap. Rip right through all that bubble wrap. Shake it out of the box. And what do we get? We've got a gorgeous Flip Sky Dual FS ESC 6.6. .6. Can't wait to get this thing going. Ooh, take it out of the bag. And we've got 10 gauge wires with all sorts of awesome capacitors, the control circuit, shunt resistors, and a USB programming port. And if you flip it over, there's a really nice heat sink on the back. All right, so what we've got is the board set up, and I had to disconnect the dual channel just so that I can have two channels on my RC receiver. And when I took the heat shrink off, I noticed that they have uh, nice silicone glue all over the capacitors to keep them from vibrating. Um, I've got the six leads hooked up to two brushless motors, 6374 motors. And I've got the battery packs here, the graphene battery packs, wired up in 12S. So this is at 12S. Both motors are independent. And I have them all with the remote. So... Not only do these motors run faster, they really actually run really well slow. They have great spin up, really smooth, no cogging, and forward to reverse slamming it right away works perfect too. All right, we've got this in the robot, stuffed in the box there going to test it on this tire for a little bit and see how it goes. Our spin-up looks nice. The drum is spinning perfect. It does weigh 110 pounds, so it's a lot of inertia to get going. We do have current limiting on, but it still doesn't seem to phase it. And uh, yeah, it works out great. So there you have it. 